Welcome to this Pedagogy Premier Digital Tip video. Welcome to the Microsoft Learn site. Here you'll find a series of modules and learning paths to develop your skills in using the Microsoft tools such as OneNote, Sway, Forms and PowerPoint. You can sign in and sign up with your Glow email address. This way you can create a log of any of the modules and learning paths that you complete. This is useful for recording your professional learning and you can upload to your GTCS profile as well. On the Microsoft Learn page, we can go into the Educator Centre and find information specific for education, such as various educator programmes that we have access to, for example, the Microsoft Educator. This is a series of modules to help earn a Microsoft Educator badge. You can see the list of modules here and you can take part in them in any order. All of the modules on the Microsoft Learn site are self-led with various text and videos to support you through. If you want to see all of the modules that are available, click Browse All Training and then use the filters down the left hand side. If I look under Roles, you'll see there is a K-12 educator and also a higher education educator. I'm going to click K-12 educator and then I can use the filter for products to choose specific things. Let's say I want to look at Office 365 you'll see that it's filtered down to different courses for me to look at. If I'm looking for a specific Office product, I click the drop down under Office and I could choose Sway, for example, and you'll see there are three different modules available. I'm going to have a look at the digital storytelling with Microsoft Sway. It will lead me through and in my own time, I can work through this module. At the end of every module, there's a knowledge check with a series of multiple choice questions. Once this is completed, you can check your answers and you'll be awarded a badge. Once you've started completing some modules and learning paths, you can go into your profile to view what you have completed. I can see here in my activity feed what I've completed over the past 30 days. But if I go to my transcript, my transcript will show me all of the modules that I have completed. I can simply click on to print, choose the option to save as a PDF and upload this to my GTCS profile. What modules are you going to explore in the Microsoft Learn Educator Centre? Thank you for watching.